The Special Olympic State Summer Games is officially underway here in Ithaca. Thousands of athletes came out here today to compete across eight different sports. This Saturday, thousands of athletes from Special Olympics New York could participate in some basketball, bowling, gymnastics, powerlifting, swimming, tennis, and track and field events. Festivities kicked off with opening ceremonies last night at 7, with the slate of sports happening all day Saturday. The games are the largest statewide competition of the year for athletes with intellectual disabilities. Our athletes are super excited to be back in the game. That's been the whole anthem of the year, getting back in the game. And I always say it is one thing to hear them talk about the sports they love, the friendships they form, and it's another thing to watch those in person. Sponsors across New York help the nonprofit generate proceeds from the event, which funds athletic expenses for athletes. Coach Ambermont expressed the importance of providing these resources for athletes. Those proceeds stay within the state of New York for all of our athletes so that they don't have to pay for anything that goes into them coming to state games. There's no money at the family or their cost to be able to come and compete and have a great time for the weekend. Now athletes competed at various locations throughout the day and while some were at Ithaca High School for a lap around the track, others came here to Ithaca College's Hill Center for some volleyball and gymnastics here in Ben Light Gymnasium. Athletes were also bowling at Midway Lanes in Vestal, New York from 10 a.m. until 3 p.m. Powerlifting and tennis ran on campus throughout the day, in addition to basketball and swimming happening in the A&E Center. Many participants were excited to jump back into a field of competition after COVID canceled the games over the last two years. Just hanging out with friends and family and just I'm finally really, really grateful that the Special Olympics finally had come to Ithaca. And athletes, coaches, and spectators can look forward next to the state fall games coming this October to Glens Falls, New York. More information on how people can donate to Special Olympics New York will be posted on our website at WENY.com. Reporting from Ithaca, Sam Shapiro, WENY News.